Keep up. I've no time for stragglers. Watch you are. Alive. We've got work to do. What does I find new on the rest? Walk on, girl. Who's a good horse? You are. Cheers. Hang on a minute. My dear Darwin, do you think our young friend here, equipped with a multiplicity of talents, might be enough to ensure Mr. Hammond safe passage? Who's Hammond when he's at home, then? A mutual friend of ours. He arrives in London today. From South Africa, no less. Mr. Hammond is possessed of both tremendous wealth and charming innocence. 
which makes him rather attractive prey for some of our great city's less savory inhabitants. We fear he'll need a more robust escort than two old men might provide. I'm not a coachman, you know. We have already told him to expect you. His train should have arrived ten minutes ago. Well, then, I suppose a friend of yours is a friend of mine. Splendid. Off you go. Come, come. Mr. John Hammond? That is correct. Jacob Fry, Mr. Dickens sent me to meet you. Oh, good old Dickens. How very kind of him. Lead on, then. All right, Jacob. London. Can't say I missed the weather. Not looking so tough now, are ya? Just seen someone get killed. Oh, I'll find out where you're buried. Oh, oh, you right. Someone's been slain. I am now officially dead, dead and have thus shed my fortune. I shall meet Bella Wilson as a noble. We shall see if she'll have me now. Come, we must dispose of my body. Find us a carriage to take us to the river. Good work. How exciting. This is like something out of a novel. Dance on your grave. It's a place like the body, the wax wheel. <laughs>
excellent. Easy! Now let us go and meet her fiance. I can't wait to see her response. I feel quite liberated, as if a great weight has been lifted from my shoulders. After this, just to be sure, would you take me to my fiancé's house? I shall deliver the sad news myself. It seems a bit risky to me. She has never set eyes on me. Besides, I need to ascertain whether I like her as well. And I want to see how she reacts to the news of my death. Come on, hurry up! This is taking far too long. You're going the wrong way, I'm sure of it. Steady on. Please hurry, I'm very anxious to meet Miss Wilson. Slow down. That's a girl. Miss Wilson? Yes? My name is John Rokesmith. I'm afraid I have some terrible news for you. Oh? Your fiancé, John Hammond, was found dead in the River Thames this morning. Oh, how awful! Poor Mr. Hammond. I am at a loss at what to say to you, sir. You must forgive me. She is delightful. Why, I do believe I love her. <laughs> Certainly an unusual first meeting to talk about in your wedding speech.